Yo, what's going on boys? It's me, Daily here. And today, what we're going to be doing is a massive field defense in Gates of Heck. Now, we're playing on hardcore difficulty, which means we have to defend for an hour. If we had played on easy, it would have been half an hour. But I thought, let's go the full nine yards, baby. So, first things first, we got to pick ourselves a faction here. Um, and, uh, oops, did I just pick the faction? Well, I guess we're Germany? <laughs> Oh, we have eight minutes to prepare. Roger that. Okay. So, uh, we are Chemini, apparently, and uh, the idea is that we have to protect our officer for as long as possible. So, let's just start marching out some of our troopers over here, boys. Uh, I think that's a grand idea. And then, is this the officer we have to protect? Or this, this looks just like a tank crewman, kind of. Oh, and this... Yeah, those might just be tank crewmen. Who do we... Oh, that's the officer I think we have to... Uh, protect right there okay roger that uh so we do have a couple yep. tank crews oh and we have panzer twos right here which is pretty helpful oh and it well one panzer two i guess which is fine uh so very pugers that is very nice uh we'll send these two guys off to the right over there and then we have uh is this a radio operator what are these guys oh field engineers oh pog okay well that could be kind of helpful right there um do we have mines that we could use oh no we have these guys are foxhole builders? They don't even have mines? Ugh! What's the point? All right, well, we can dig some large foxholes, I suppose. Um, let's build them closer. Can only one of them dig foxholes? What's the point of the other guy? Oh, no, he can dig foxholes, too. Oh, I'm just very confused. Yeah, let's build these closer over here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Mines, 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 mines. Oh, that's super helpful. Okay, Pog. Um, yeah, give me those mines, please, and you will be in charge of mining. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and mine the entrance here and, uh, really focus on the last stand defense for those guys. Um, and in addition, the tanks, too, I think we're gonna focus on, uh, for the last stand defense. Just really making sure, uh, we're fine right in there. Okay, so now we should probably go ahead and, uh, summon some infantry. So let's go ahead and get ourselves an infantry team. Um... Yeah, probably an AT team, a sniper team, and then uh, MG team. I, I think that's probably all we're going to purchase for now from that. I think that's probably enough. Uh, and then we could also go ahead and get some armor. There's a tank upgrade. What does that even mean? Oh, it means you get, like, different tanks. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Um... It's kind of costly to do that, though. Very costly. Um, eh, well, let's do that. Let's let's upgrade our tanks. And then let's get another Panzer 1B, I think is probably a good idea. Okay, and our boys are spawning over here. Not the largest amount of infantry, but I guess it is what it is, boys. So we'll send those guys out this way. All right, these guys are still mining slash setting up some random foxholes for us, which is fine. I think I'll have the second guy start uh actually i'll send this tank out and then we'll just keep one tank in to defend right there um oh we got more units in which is nice okay cool uh are they no that's the same units okay never mind that's fine that's fine all right cool by the way guys if you do enjoy these videos please be sure to hit that like button it really really helps me out tremendously um in the algorithm subscribe if you haven't already and uh comment down below if you'd like to see some more of these gates of heck uh videos because i think they're kind of entertaining um okay so we do have an mg over there it looks like there are objects over here we can man oh no they're just the uh ammo crates over here well we'll stick this guy over here then at the ammo crates probably fine um and then the tank over here i guess we'll send you forward and you can hang out in the pit right over there which would probably be a good idea okay now, we do have uh, these guys over this way uh, that we can set up along these defenses on the right side. I'm wondering if maybe I should be setting up a little bit closer to the officer, but I suppose we can always do a bit of a fallback. Yo, there's a Valentine out here that is tracked or something. We'll go check that out and see if that is crewable. There's something out here, too. Oh, it's just a random fuel truck. I don't really need a fuel truck, I don't think. Is there anything else we could just sort of snag? There's a train. <laughs> we could get the train. Yes. Very nice. Um, 
No, we do not want the train. <laughs> I'm afraid. Uh, Alright, we'll send these guys out more towards mid then, I suppose. Uh, which could probably be a little bit more helpful. You go out that way. Yeah, I guess we will start with a bit more of a frontal defense here if you will a defense that is a bit more in the face of the enemy we'll get that guy in that little bunker right there um and then i suppose as they come closer and we start losing positions we'll start backing it up because this is an hour-long defense and truth be told we're going to probably need much of that time so uh, it'll be good to just have a bit of a forward start on the enemy here uh that we can we can really dig ourselves into which which should be pretty helpful um okay so yeah i'm just setting up the boys around the right side the right side is definitely our better defensive side uh let's go ahead and get some repairs on that valentine's we only have two minutes so hopefully these two troopers can repair it fast enough it looks like it is engine damage as well as track so uh that might be a tough repair engines take a very very long time to repair let's toss that guy in there those guys are all set up fine okay uh we probably want to set these guys up a little bit better why are you guys set up the way that you are what is this Set up like that. There you go. And we'll just have one guy in that and then one guy backing up over there, I suppose. Yeah. And then we have a Panza uh, Faust Tripar who can go over there, which is just dandy swell. Uh, right here we have a nice uh, Panza Grandia as well who can chill. We'll go ahead and put that guy over there. Okay. Yeah. Very sparse in terms of defenses right now um oh yeah we did upgrade to level two tanks but it looks like we can't really afford any of them great uh well let's get one at the very least i think will be helpful um and then we're also going to need some more infantry so let's just get another infantry team out here too and hopefully they can make it in time uh because yeah we're definitely definitely going to need uh some more boys up here we we don't have an especially large defense currently especially on the left side where we are seriously lacking in terms of infantry uh so i think yeah this tank did just come in so we'll send that tank over here real real quick uh does this guy still have mines no he does not uh does this guy have mines search it there you go um yeah this guy will we'll just get these two mining together they could just mine the entire day <laughs> until the enemies inevitably show up at our doorstep they'll just continuously be the minor boys okay cool um all right let's send this tank down mid and then yeah this tank is gonna go to the far left we're really gonna be heavily relying i think on a tank presence on the left right now as defenses uh because this infantry is going to take a spell uh to actually get on up here so yeah we're gonna need some some tankus please tanku then nice um and then we should also go ahead and get another infantry team up here too which would be helpful okay well we got 30 seconds on the clock right now um this is not a good mining position no never mind just mine like this mine like that yeah yeah, yeah. mine more towards entrances that would be good all right um and eventually i do want to have a little team here just protecting the officer at all costs because he is our objective um at the end of the day he is the one who if he dies, we lose the game. So we do need to keep him in tip-top shape uh, during this whole thing. Okay, we'll send that infantry team out there. And we'll get one more infantry team. And defend your position. Okay, we have an hour. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, one of these guys finished up repairing. Uh, oh, the engine got repaired. And look, he just repaired the track. Oh, that's very, very big. Okay, we've already got enemies coming on out here. But nothing big. Nothing too scary. Uh, so that's good for us. Um... No! The engine's perma-damage! We can't move it! Oh, we can't move it! Oh, oh no! It's out of fuel! That's probably what that fuel truck up there was for. But you know what? Getting that fuel is such a pain in the butt. We'll just leave those two troopers in there and they can just defend it. Um, honestly, it'll probably be fine considering the fact that uh, it's got a big gun. It'll last a few waves at the very least, I'm hoping. I say reluctantly. <laughs> All right, how about you, little teeny tiny Panza man? Um, oh yeah, you are in a 
great spot. <laughs> awesome. Okay, let's see here. We have a Gaz 67B coming on forward here. Um, and it is going to start firing into our boys back here. Already getting a few hits. Wow, this tiny little Penza 1 can't even fire over the hill. So we're going to actually move that. Uh, and hopefully as we move it, it can take out this thing. Oh, no. That thing's engines just got popped. It is now on fire. It's probably going to go down right there. Good, 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 good. We love to see that. Okay. We do have some more infantrymen coming forward over here and another Gaz B, but we should have enough uh, tank defense to uh, really eliminate those guys pretty early on, which is good. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, we did get another squad in, which is good. So I'm going to start actually uh, setting up defensive lines a little bit farther back uh, and, and we'll start tiering our defenses out uh, throughout this battle. Um, okay, we can also set these guys up a little bit better because currently they are in a bit of a wacky position um yeah these guys could definitely use a little bit better positioning uh throughout this trench here and then also the far left could use some better <laughs> well just troopers in general it could use troopers in general boys uh which would be great uh yeah we'll set that guy up right there beautiful we love to see it um and those guys are fine up there a tank right about here would be pretty glorious um we'll move this penza a little bit more that way which should be i think a little bit helpful okay in this tank we are going to put in the gutter down here what do they have coming in okay just more gauzes so these panzers should be able to deal with these gauzes really really easily for the start at the very least uh and even the russian infantry isn't coming forward that much oh this gauze out here got shredded which is good to see looks like this thing took it out um can we maybe like kill the infantry around it there's one uh the other one's kind of hiding I just kind of want to get these guys out of the way beautifully done beautifully done all right let's get a cell i cannot talk let's get ourselves a second infantry team up here that would be grand uh, i think those guys are going to be the backbone of this army of course infantry always is um all right and we'll start spreading these fellas out uh, across the lines here which would be good and helpful okay get moving get moving boys all right um you can go over there, and then you can be back up back here. Okay, we do have a little bit of an engagement going on over here. Oh, we've also got more vehicles coming in, and they're getting universal carriers, which is actually kind of interesting, because those are usually used to tow vehicles, um, or r rather AT guns, but it's not carrying an AT gun. Uh, so I guess that's probably fine for us. Also, what is a Valentine doing out here? I don't know why that just struck me. I don't know, maybe some sort of Lend-Lease type deal with the Soviets and the Commonwealth? Um, not sure about that one. We got a BA coming out here, two of them, actually. Uh, so yeah, our tanks should still be able to uh, shred those. Uh, they have yet to really evolve into anything that would kill our boys too hard. Um, so that's good for us. I'm actually going to get an AT team now, and then I'll bring up these guys here. And I think we're going to position them maybe more in the central area over this way. Like, that would be helpful. Oh, yeah, these guys desperately need to be split up a little bit more. So let's get them moving and grooving into different positions. I think that's a good idea. Um, okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, these trenches are really hard to align troopers in for some reason. I don't know what's up with that. It's kind of frustrating. Okay, but yeah, we'll get troopers like that. And we'll uh, actually, you, you come up over to the right over here, bud. Okay, cool. Middle is becoming more and more geared up. Oh, there's a crossroads right here where Opal Blitzes are going through. That's interesting. Maybe that's some sort of resupply thing. That actually could be it. All right. Um, let's go ahead and get some level 2 tanks up here. Panzer 3N should be pretty effective, so we'll buy that. Uh, and then let's also get ourselves... Let's tank upgrade again so we can get level 3 tanks. I, I think we're in a good position where we can actually upgrade... A decent amount right now and still be okay all right and here's our anti-tank guns right here these are a good one to sort of keep more in the back as a final fallback in case our tanks falter against other enemy uh tanks so that's a good thing to have over there and we'll bring this tank over here towards the left side what do they got coming in now all right more universal carriers all right nothing too crazy going on right here Ooh, one second guys hold the phone Hey boys, sorry about that. I just received a call that I completely forgot was happening and that I needed to take. Okay, 
Either way, we've got reinforcements coming in. Let's send these guys far left, I think. And then our tank, I forget where we said to put it, but it's going to come in either way. Okay, I am anticipating that probably at the 10 minute mark or so here, we're going to see a lot more infantry coming forward from the enemy, uh, which could be a bit of a problem. We'll see what ends up happening there. Okay, a little carrier coming on forward. How's our, how's our tank doing, by the way? Let's see. Can we snipe this thing out? Uh... Did that get it? It's hard to tell. I think it did. I think we just decrewed it, actually. Can we go snipe it? Wait, hold on. Can we go yank this thing? Nah, it's dead. Oh, they're all dead, dead. Oh, set. Oh, this one. This one's still alive. Uh, it doesn't even look engine damaged. That thing actually looks flawless. This one as well. <laughs> Do you think we should try and get some folks forward? Uh, the problem is there is a lot of infantry out there. Yeah, uh, it's probably not worth it. For a for a BA, nah, thanks. Maybe if they were sending for T-34-76s or something like that, it'd be a different story. I'd be like, ooh, might as well go cop. But nah, with these, not really worth it. Honestly, this tank not doing tremendously well. It's only getting a few kills, which is a bit of a bummer, but I guess it is what it is. Are you, like, having trouble firing? Like, what is your deal? This guy, This guy's, like, not firing at all. Let's get him in this foxhole instead. Maybe that'll help him out. I don't know, I'd like to optimize positions here a little bit more. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? Why don't you heal up there, champ? My champ? Alright, let's check out the armor. Um, okay, so we do have level 3 tanks we can get now. We can get a Panzer 4D. We can get Stug. We can get Panzer... Oh, a 4F1 would actually not be too bad. I'd like to stay on top of the tank upgrades because the second they start throwing in like T-34s and stuff like that, we're going to be in trouble. And I'd rather have an upgraded tank capable of taking those things out sooner rather than later. Like, I don't want to have to desperately send forward a tank defense uh, because, oh shoot, I forgot to actually like buy any proper tanks. You know, I want to I stay on top of this thing. I want to make sure that we're still all Gucci. Okay, we do have a couple squads that need some placements here. So we'll go ahead and toss them a lot in these foxholes, I'm thinking. Um, yeah, we can definitely spread out our boys a little bit better. Let's get someone in that bunker right there. Uh, and yeah, just sort of re-equip a lot of our front lines here with more infantry soldiers. Infantry soldiers are definitely something uh, that we're in need of. Just spreading them out as much as possible. Okay, and then on top of that, let's go ahead and, and search up uh, the bin right here again for some more AP mines. Currently, obviously, in the back here, we're doing just fine. We've, we've got no problems with our officer currently. But again, there's still 51 minutes to defend here, and that's a lot of time for some nastiness to happen. Okay, there we go. Got more mines for these guys. Um, so we can go ahead and spread them out somewhere. So we have both em entrances here covered. Um, I feel like in this tree line would be a good spot because that's an area with a lot of cover for the enemy to utilize when they come on forward here. So let's get that done right there. I'm also going to go ahead and buy an infantry team. And this infantry team is going to stay with the officer here because the last thing we need is some breakaway push from the Russians happening where the Russians managed to get super, super far forward and start taking out our boys. Uh, and then we're just sort of stuck out and we got to panic create some sort of distraction or something like that you know we need uh some boys in the back basically is what i'm saying ready to defend this thing actually did take some engine damage here it does have 11 kills and one vehicle kill now which is good uh but i believe it's immobile oh no it's still fine what's this damage it says it's got a bunch of engine damage that's maybe it's just weakened is that a thing in gates of heck I actually don't remember. It might be a thing. Who knows? Okay. Either way, uh, yeah, here's our infantry squad here. Let's just go ahead and plop them in this thing, and uh, we could spread them out a bit more a little bit later on. I think the right side here, we've been neglecting a little bit too much. We do have a good number of troopers there, but we've been sending most reinforcements over this way. Uh, so maybe getting something a bit bigger over on the right would be better. Uh, how is this thing doing, by the way? It does have six tank kills and six infantry kills. So even though it's butt is completely facing the enemy, which is like the weakest part of a tank. It's still doing okay. All right, they're still sending forward troop carriers and stuff like that, so that's not too big of a worry for us. Oh yeah, we have this squad here that we just received, so let's go ahead and split them up a little bit here uh, and make sure that they're in some proper places uh, where they can actually be effective. Why don't we send a, a few of them forward here? Then actually, uh, yeah, these two can stay a bit more in the back. And then one could go over there, I guess? I don't know. Yeah, sure. Why not? That's 
That's a good play. Yeah, the left side, we are definitely on track for a good defense over here. All right, why don't we go ahead and spread out a lot of these guys here and, uh, you know, get them into a bit better, proper positions. Yeah, I think this is actually pretty solid. Um, we can spread you guys out a little bit more as well, which is to be very nice. And then, of course, we've always got our... AP miners here who are still laying down some track, baby. Um, let's just cop a couple more over that way and that'll be fine. All right, what are they setting for now? Ooh! They're setting for gases with uh, AA guns on top of them. Okay, that's a little bit something different. That could actually penetrate a few of our tanks, uh, which would obviously not be the greatest thing ever. I'm gonna keep this thing just like in this dip of this hill. I think that's actually a pretty decent spot. Or maybe we should send it down to the bottom. Maybe down in the in the canyon area would be a little bit better. Let's not break that wall, though. Yeah, that might be a better option. This thing's just sort of chilling here. It's not really got too much going on. We do have 800 MP. I want to continuously use our MP here. Uh, so let's go ahead and purchase something fun. A Panzer 4H is powerful. Let's get that thing up here. That'll be kind of nuts, actually. All right, and we'll move this around. Yeah, we are actually advancing our tech way faster than they're advancing their tech, which makes me think towards the end of this thing, they're going to get some massive bonuses that'll be very difficult to deal with, I have a feeling. All right, where's this gas? There it is. Ooh, it's probably, yeah, hitting this thing. All right, Valentine, turn it around, buddy. Turn her around. Let's get this thing down. All right, and skadoosh. Oh, yeah, there are the fireworks. The problem is that the AA gun can stay alive while the truck is damaged, but the crew might evacuate. Uh, the AA gun. Ah, uh, there we go. They did evacuate. Good, good, good. Ooh, what's this? A BA-6. I believe that's actually a new weapon to Gates of Heck. We're already hitting it pretty good with some AA fire. That should be able to penetrate it. Yep, it is breaking down now. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, we do have more. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, I thought that was an anti-tank gun. No, it's another AA gun, but over here we have a T-37A, the first of the actual tanks coming in for the Rushkis here. BA-6, okay, and then uh, another gas AA gun. Okay, they are definitely bringing forward some more powerful stuff here. Uh-oh, this thing is actually dead dead, and we can't pick up any sort of thing from it. Why don't we go ahead and send you over to the Valentine then, uh, considering the fact that you are just a tank crewman, we can get someone over there with them. Okay, where's our next tank? Because, okay, there it is. Panzer 4H. This is actually a pretty good tank. This is a great tank, actually, and we're going to put it into the divot over here and have it defend uh, the right side, which is desperately in need of that. Okay, uh, we actually have some troopers running out of ammo here, so we're going to run them on back here, and we can replace him with another trooper here. A uh, bunch of our boys need some healing. Oh, they're getting shot up here. Uh, you also need ammo right here, buddy, so why don't you head on back here, too? I think we need to purchase ourselves a little bit of a medic currently for the right side, which is in a bit of turmoil currently, and also another infantry team for this side as well. Okay, you guys go ahead and search up that mine uh, satchel again, because we're going to continuously lay down some mines here. Okay, so medic coming up over to the right side. Uh, we need you over there, and then we'll also send the infantry team on over to the right side as well, I'm thinking. Yeah, the left is still holding pretty well. I don't think the left is really in need of much, so I can just sort of chill with that over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The right side is where we're definitely in a bit more of a danger zone. We'll go ahead and move this thing forward here now uh, so it can get a little bit more involved. We've got tank deployments going on right now, which is great. Uh, are you guys going to come and search the box like I told you to? Come on, boys. We need action. Okay. Um... Yeah, go ahead and get those mines. Actually, you know what? Get, get this guy involved, too. We might as well use this squad to its fullest and just really start deploying these things. Okay, so these are anti-tank mines. Um, so we're going to spread them all the way across like that, uh, where tanks are likely to come from. Uh, and you know what? Screw it. Let's get let's get some more troopers from this squad mining, because right now the enemy is nowhere near here. Uh, so we might as well mine it on up uh, while we have the chance. Scout is coming over and saying hi and biting my hand playfully. <laughs> What's up, dude? What's cracking? Oh, nope. Don't eat that. Okay, Scout is bored. <laughs> you can always tell when Scout gets bored. So I'm going to real quick run him outside. I'll be right back. Sorry for the interruption. All right, boys, Scout went outside, had a great time. We're all good on that front. So what we have going on right now is uh, just sort of continued attack here, except, oh, what is this? T-27s? 
Well, that's the cruddiest little tank I ever did see. Saw T37 A and BT2. Okay, so they are getting a little bit more spicy here. These T70Ms are a little bit of a worry. Our Panzers might go down to them. Uh, okay, these troopers also need to go back and refuel on some ammunition. But our next squad is up here, so we can go ahead and uh, get them up participating in the battle. We'll just run them on up here. Uh, oh my god, all of our soldiers running out of ammo right now. That's so annoying. That is definitely one of the major problems with a battle like this is that the attrition will eventually kind of get to you and your soldiers and you're going to need to go ahead and uh, reorganize a little bit. So that's what we're doing right now. Okay, so we're going to push those guys over that way. That tank is dead. I forgot about that. Ooh, where's the medic? Medic, 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 medic. Go heal, heal the buster over there. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah, but we do have that Panzer 4H right there, which is just going to be unbelievable. All right, how's the left side doing? The uh, side that I'm kind of neglecting a little bit, but it's fine that I'm doing that because guess what? Nothing at all has happened over here. Nothing in the slightest. We'll move that over that way. Those trucks are continuing to move out, which is good. Um, okay, okay. This man is now healing. Beautiful. Uh, these guys acquiring the goods. We'll leave them there to do that for a little while. Uh, and we will push this soldier up this way. And then move these guys around a little bit just like that, which is glorious. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Is this soldier back alive? He is indeed. All right. The medic can just sort of stay laying down right there. I think that's fine. As long as he's in cover, he should be all gravy, baby. Okay, did you guys mine it up? You didn't get super far in the mines, but that's all right. Uh, why don't you mine a little bit more over there? You've got a few more at your disposal right there. We've also got these troopers right here who we can go ahead and have uh, commence the mining as well. The mining. Let's get them on the mining path, baby. Let's get it done. Okay, cool. Um, what is hitting us over here? Oh, is it this thing? Yeah, that's a BT-2 hitting us hard right there. Uh, T-70M coming in. What do we got? Okay. Okay. Oh, geez, I just got shot That's back over here to the mining out. community right now. The Minecraft community. Beautiful. All right, get to mining. Um, I'm thinking maybe a little bit more like this. I, I don't know. We're just kind of throwing them down wherever, dude. <laughs> It doesn't matter too much uh, as long as they get some mines down somewhere. Okay, so yeah over here They were bringing in some nastiness. Okay. Yeah, su 76 is the first real tank. Oh They do have Valentine's which is very bizarre t26. Oh Valentine's okay, they're bringing in real tanks now. This is where things get a little bit more tricky Luckily, we do have a buttload of cash right now So I am gonna go ahead and bring up a second Panzer thought itch um which is right there. All right, bring in another Panzer IV H, and that should be helpful. And an F1. Why not? Bring in a second F1. F1s are still pretty viable at this point in time. So get those tanks on up here, and that'll be lovely. Um, I'm going to just leave the small tanks where they lie, because honestly, they might go down, but that is A-OK -okay with me, because if they go down, it doesn't really matter <laughs> that much you know it's not the biggest deal in the world okay we're gonna move troopers over around these ways actually let's get let's get this squad that just reloaded all its ammo over this way defending over here there is a leaf blower outside so i'm gonna pause real quick and let that pass i know there's a lot of pausing going on right now i apologize it's all of a sudden just a chaotic morning for me okay hopefully we're good for a little while here <laughs> it's a chaotic day in the daily household. All right, they are having some congestion over here, which is good, but they are bringing in bigger and bigger tanks now. Yikes for us, dog. Okay, however, our tanks have arrived, so, um, gonna plop one of the Penzas over here, yas, and then the other one, I think we're gonna bring over here. Yeah, we'll, we'll split it between the two sides. I think that's probably the best idea we can do. Those guys are still mining. These guys have finished up mining, uh, which is beautiful, beautiful. You love to see. Very nice. So we'll bring them over here then. Um, okay. Yeah, lots of action going on. Look at this tank graveyard. <laughs> there is a lot of dead Soviet tanks over here. Oh, no. Oh, that thing was a beaut too. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That thing got so many kills. Okay. Well, rip, rip, potato chip. Um, there are no machine guns in it for us to acquire. We'll just plop those guys like that right there for now. Actually, you know what? Bring them back here. 
We're gonna come back here and we'll plop these guys a little bit farther forward as a replacement for the tank for now. Just get a couple more guns over there. Uh, and then these tank crewmen can chill back here uh, and fire out at whoever they see. I don't really expect them to get any kills at all, but hey, it is what it is. Luckily, we do have some more tanks over here, although this one is now engine damage. Let's get some repairs down on that thing. The left side is struggling with these new tanks coming up right now. So hopefully this Panzer IV H gets here real quick like uh, and can stop this push. Yeah, I think right down center right here is good. We'll keep it just below the lip of this hill. See if it can fire over it. If they can fire over it, that's actually going to be gorgeous for us. Um, okay, that trooper's dead. The medic is super duper far away. I don't really want to move him in. All right, this comes a... Uh, uh, F right here can move forward just a smidge, just like that, I guess. Yep, can fire perfectly, beautiful, uh, and we'll keep this trooper right in front of him right there. Okay, cool stuff. Uh, Penza 4H also doing its work uh, nicely. Let's scooch it on up here just a little bit, make it a little bit more accurate, and boom, baby! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Okay, beautiful stuff, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Oh! The medic has been dislodged from his position. All right, we need infantry. We need infantry in here, baby. All right, get me an infantry team. Give me a motorized specialized team as well and an MG team right now. That's going to be good stuff right there. All right, bring this guy back to reload his ammo right now. Um, ooh, the uh, the Valentine did end up going down. That was bound to happen once they got real tanks in there. But hey, that thing fought very, very hard and did a wonderful job for us. Okay, this thing is still getting repaired. Might end up going down. It did wonderful work for us as well. We've got more troopers back here dying, which is not good. We need to bring this tank up and over. It looks like it is not really able to fire super easily from there. Uh, just go ahead and take some pot shots right there, but make sure you get your butt up there, buddy. Okay. All right. Um, should we call in... Request to call in support. I don't know what that even means, but we'll do it. Sure. Uh, and let's tank upgrade real quick while we have the chance, because you could tell lots of uh, enemy tanks are going to be coming up here. Let's get an infantry team in here too now, and that's going to be all of our points for now. What is this? Oh, SU-12. Oh, God. Ugh, no. Okay. Not good stuff. All right. Motorized infantry, head this way. Head that way. We got more infantry teams coming up as well. We need to reinforce real quick here. So let's get these units up, up, up. Come on, boys. Let's get on up here. All right. Get up there. And then we've got one more team right here. Uh, and we will send them off to the left over here, which would be great. Um... Yeah, get them in these trenches over here. Oh, so many of our troopers are dying now. Oh, no. This thing already got hit hard? That's the problem with this. Is like we can't re-put it into the tank traps because guess what? <laughs> There's a dead tank in there now. So it makes it harder to defend those things. Oh, jeez. Um, oh, repair, repair, repair. Just bail out and start repairing it. Just bail out and start repairing it. This thing is toasted as well. Okay, left side is starting to crumble a little bit here. This is not good. Get these guys up here. What are you doing? Come on, folks. Move it. Move your buttholes. Okay. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. We got miners here. Let's go ahead and uh, load on up with AT mines right now. That's going to be beautiful. 49 of them. 49. Okay. Um, why don't you head down here? And lay down that track right there. We're going to start mining a little bit farther out with those fellas. Bring these guys back here and get some uh, stuff in you there too. Okay, uh, so we do have level 4 tanks now, but we're going to have to wait a while to actually purchase them. Because we're a little bit broke, boys. We are a little bit broke. Okay, let's bail out the motorized crew here. And we can actually bring this thing forward too uh, with the, uh, the gunners. And they can start firing away if need be. We do have a medic in here, which should be kind of nice actually. That is going to be pretty nice. Let's get you guys in there just for now. Um, we'll bring this thing forward and actually park it behind the Penza 4. Oh, God! Massive infantry push over here from the Rushkis. Oh, uh, bring it over here. Bring it over here. Come on. All right. Jeez, Louise. Um, all right. We'll move these guys around a little bit, too. The tank crewman defense. The tank crewman defense. You love to see it. Okay. Uh, we're going to need these guys over here. Go, infantry. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Right now. Right now, move it. Okay. Alrighty then. We should be fine if we can distribute our units nicely here. 
and uh, start the, the defense again. We need to kind of kickstart this thing. Okay, those guys are mining. That's all good and well. How are you guys doing over here on the left? Um, should we go ahead and build some foxholes here? Nah, that's uh, kind of a waste of time. Let's, let's just go get these guys set up here. The problem is with Gates of Heck, you kind of got to set up individually. It's a lot harder to set up your troopers um, in mass with Gates of Heck compared to like men of war. So you kind of do have to be a little bit more methodical with what you're doing here. So uh, we'll go ahead and do that. All right, you're still doing okay. Oh, you're getting hit so hard, bro. Ooh, try and do some repairs there, I guess. Um, you're still just chilling right here. That's fine and dandy and swell. Nope, just chill there. Just chill there. You move like that, I suppose. All right, we're going to bring this up a little bit here. And position it like right about this way. Uh, that hit a tree. Awesome. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's see. Did our infantry get here? Oh, they did and they died. Where's our medic? Where'd that medic go? Is it his, this guy? This is this guy. Okay. Move him over this way. And we'll try... Oh, it's going to take way too long to revive that guy. Nope, never mind. We can't do that. All right, is this thing repaired? It is! Yes! Glorious! Glory, glory, glory. Okay, you last tank crewman. Get on over here. All right, um... And actually, where'd that medic go? There he is right there. Um, there is a guy you could probably help him out. And that'd be just fine and dandy. All right, we need support. Bombing run. Already strike to forest. Um, I don't know what to do! Let's bombing run right here. Bombing run right there. And then we can focus a little bit easier on the left side over this way. Alright, did our, uh, where'd our mechanized vehicle go? I think it must have died or blown up or something? I'm not totally sure. Oh, here comes the bombing run. Let's see how this goes. This would be fun to see. Let's see. Come on. Give me something big. Oh, it does fire uh, its uh, turrets as well, which is kind of cool. There we go. Ah! Oh, my God. It overshot. Oh, it overshot. There we have a Churchill. All right. Already strike to forest. Do the already strike to forest now. Get that going. Get that moving. Get that grooving. Oh, dear Lord. Oh, no. All right. There's the already strike to the forest. It's tearing it up, but it missed the Churchill completely. Yikes. All right, how are you doing here, trooper? Nice. Nice. All right. Oh, come on, heal. Er, er, just stay alive. Just stay alive. Just stay alive. No! We were so close. Sad. All right. Um, can we get level 4 tanks yet? Uh, we could get a Panzer uh, 756. Jawohl. That will be fine. Um, okay, we need... We need forces over here, boys. We need boys over here, boys. Oh, God, you died again instantly. I just revived you. Oh, there's our mechanized vehicle that's down. Okay, and the pens up for edge went down there, too. No. Okay, um, we need you to get in here. Soldat. Go, soldat. Yeah, you guys just crouch down there until we can get reinforcements to you. There we go. There's our big boy tank. There's our big boy tank. Get it up here. Please. All right. Yeah, we'll, we'll fight in these divots. We'll fight in these divots. We don't want to We don't want to lose ground. Um, okay, we need an infantry team as well. We desperately need an infantry team here. Okay, you guys can start mining again. Um, yeah, get yourself some of them mines, and that'll be fine. And spread them out that way. And then you guys can return to your post back here and start mining as well pretty soon here. We need to solidify this position here. Oh, jeez. And that is a tough ask. All right. Move up. Move up. No. you got to be kidding me. You guys have grenades, right? How far can you throw them? Not that far. Run and throw it. Why not? Short. Why not? It's not going to do anything. Get on the ground. <laughs> uh, can you go revive this guy? I don't know. We're just doing nothing good over here. Um, oh, my God. This stupid little position right here. Oh. It's killing me. It's killing me. All right. Get me an MG team. Get me an MG team over here. We need to set up. We need to set up. We need to do it now. All right. Get, like, right there. 
and then you should uh, maybe you could fire over that that would be lovely if you could lovely 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 all right move this at team over here uh, we're going to get them a little bit closer to the left side because that's obviously where we're crumbling right now. Right side's still doing okay. Y'all are still doing fine, I hope. Yeah. I hope. All right, you're dead. That tank is gone. Whatever. Who cares? How, how are you guys doing? You guys aren't doing well, huh? You guys are not doing okay, huh? Anyone got a... Any Anyone got an AT rifle? <laughs> any, any AT riflers? Boys. Please? Please? Someone! Um. Nope. Nope. Yes! There he is. There's the man of the hour. The AT Rifleman. Come on back this way, buddy. Alright, and you get in that right there. Okay, cool. Can you fire? You can. Hold this position here. Just hold out. Just hold out. Okay. We're gonna work on retaking this position right here, too. Which will be glorious. Okay. You guys still mining? You guys are still mining. You love to see it. Keep on mining, baby. All right, and you guys are going to go search this thing. And you are going to pull out oh, all of the anti-tank mines that you can. All of the anti-tank mines that you can. 49 of them. That's gorgeous. That's beautiful. Uh, and we're actually going to go ahead and start laying them down right around here. Start laying them down there. Uh, we'll make a big line right there before we lose this position. We'll start mining that up, which will be good. Okay. We're still holding out. We are still holding out, which is nice to see. Okay, this thing, we're going to just keep it under this lip. I don't even care. We're just keeping it under that lip right there. Oh, yeah. How's the right side? Where's our anti-tank man? There he is. There he is. There he is. All right. The Churchill's right there. All right. Oh, right in the engine. And it did nothing. Awesome. All right. Reload. Reload. Let's get this SU first. Oh god, oh god, no, no, no. Please don't shoot me. Um, not sure that really did all that much. Awesome. Alright, get on the ground. Nope, that's not the hotkey anymore, apparently. Awesome. Woohoo! Can we bomb the forest again? Nope, that was a one time deal. Sad. Um, boys. Alright, do we have Penza 4 H? We don't have enough money for Penza 4 H. Um,. All right, we're gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to wait. Um, all right, you guys are out of ammo. Retreat back here if you can. Oh, yikes, dude. All right, you're still holding out here, but we do have a Churchill coming on up. We do got ourselves a Churchill coming on up. Miners are coming. Um, ooh, we do have infantry. We do have some infantry. Uh, all right, we might need to start setting up our secondary defensive line back here with the infantry. Um, yeah, it might just be a requirement at this point. Considering the fact that we are not holding super duper awesome pooper uh, over here. Um, anyone got something to deal with that? Nope, nope. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Go, go, go. Why is change stance not macroed anymore? What is this? All right. Uh, I did just get some income. Can we afford any? Um... Oh, dear Lord. Level. You know, can, we, can we afford level four tanks is the question. Level four tanks? We can afford one more of those things. Those... That big tank. We'll get another big tank. Give me another big tank. Oh my god. Oh, this is a disaster, folks. Rootin' tootin' disaster. Okay. This guy's got a got a Panzerfaust. We'll send him to the right side over here. Oh, they're getting awfully close. Alright, you. Come on. Get on over here. You are our only hope, Obi-Wan Kenobi. We also do have AT mines here, which is good. So they won't cross this line super easily. So that's great for us. Oh my god, how are you already in need of repairs? What is up with our tanks? Why do they suck? We have German engineering. And we're like poo poo squad. Why are we the poo poo squad? Alright, get to mining, get to mining. Alright, prepare that thing, please. Alright, here comes this. Moving on up here. Let's start shelling those tanks. 26 minute defense. Here we go. All right, we're at 100% efficiency with this tank. Let's pop some caps. We are failing to pop some caps. Okay. It's fine, it's fine. All right. Oh! No! Oh, we're at like 2% efficiency. Get some soldiers in there. All right, wait, hold up. We got a big hit. Did it destroy? I can't tell. 
All right, aim. Oh, wait, this one. Oh, beautiful track. And that's on a that's on a Nancy tank gun. That's easy. No, it's gone again. It is gone again. It is gone again. Beautiful. You love to see it. All right. Oh, our Opal Blitzes are starting to falter, which might mean we lose uh, the reinforcements, which would be an absolute disaster for us. All right, move over here. Come on. Go, 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 go. And... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, that's tracked. That's tracked. Get off the rock. Get off the rock. Okay, good. No, 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 no. Turn. Pivot. Pivot. Fire. No, we couldn't get it off. Okay, sad. Um, all right, you guys need to spread out now, y'all. Spread out now, y'all. Come on, boys. Spread it on out. Yikes. Can you repair this? Yes, you can. Good, good, good. All right, that Opal Blitz did manage to get away, which is good for us. Is this thing repaired? It is, but now it's tracked and its gun is a little bit shaky. Awesome. All right, come on, man. These are good hits. They're just, Churchills have such strong armor. Come on. That thing's gotta be damaged, right? Let's just aim for the gun. It might be gun damage. It might be gun damage. That's good. That is good for us right there. Okay. Yeah, you guys continue to just hold out right there. We are holding on by a string. But it's fine. Okay, you have an anti-tank grenade. We're sending you out. <laughs> Sorry, pal. You're going out there. Let me take a sip of the bean juice. Mmm. Delicious bean juice. You gotta love it. All right. Look at that goofy. Look at that goofy KV2. All right, come on. Go, go, go. Run. Run. Get it. Yes. Yes. It did nothing. Why? Oh, you just hate to see it so, 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 so much. Oh, my God. All right, we need to save for a panther. We need to save for a panther. Okay, this thing might... Oh, my God, please hit that. Please. No. Why? Why? Okay, anyone got an AT grenade? One of you does. Go! Get on over there. Take it out. Go, go, go. And hit the engine. Oh, please don't kill our Opal Blitz. <laughs> um, it might just shoot our Opal Blitz. No, it's just letting it go. Is it? It must be. Oh, it might be uh, it might be damaged. It might be damaged. That doesn't mean the other ones won't kill it. We need those Opal Blitzes. All right. Uh, we tracked it. I think it's pretty heavily damaged, so there's nothing we really need to worry about with that, I guess. I don't, I don't know. Um, dude, any tank grenades? Right here, right here. Right in here. And you have a two. All right, we'll send you over this way like this. And then you'll just uh, eat it, I guess. Go, go, go. Yes. Yes, we got one. Let's go. It's the little victories, boys. It is the little victories that count. Okay, how's this thing doing? Uh, it is in pain. It is heavily in pain. Um, completely immobilized. That happens. And it's launching HE because it's out of AP. Awesome! So this thing is basically a turd. Just trying to HE shoot this thing. <laughs> That's not gonna work, obviously, but hey. I guess we try what we got. Uh, can we call in support? Huh? We can't really afford to, can we? Oh, uh, the Opal Blitz is getting shot up, which is why we're not getting any more reinforcements, really. Um, all right, sound the retreat, sound the retreat. Get the soldiers back here. We got 21 minutes here. And we need to, we need to hunker down. Give me AT teams, sniper teams, MG teams. And then, uh, okay, what, what kind of tanks can we get? We can't even get level three tanks, really. Um, you get level two, so we'll get a Panzer 3N. It's it's nothing incredible. It is nothing incredible. But it is what it is. Okay. Let's get you guys spread out across there. Alright, there's our tank. 
Bring it back here. Yeah, we are now hunkering down. Hopefully, like, this tank can, like, hold out for a little while longer. Um, oh, it does have a P A T rounds? Why did it switch? Oh, my God. Sorry, guys. Had to quickly uh, stop and start recording. You know how it be. Oh, this thing's still getting repaired. <laughs> this soldier's probably going to die before anything's actually done, but it is what it is. Um, okay. Yeah, I mean, we're in final stand mode here. <sighs> it's not looking okay. It is not looking okay. We are not okay, boys. We are not okay. Um, basically, we just need to defend our mans here for as long as flipping possible. And once we've achieved that, then we die. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, yep. Um, I guess we can get another infantry team. Get one more infantry team. Why don't you get up there? Um, we'll have a couple infantry men like in the dugout with him, and that'll be helpful. Yeah, sharpshooter right there. That's pretty nice. Why don't we move you to be like behind these barrels? It's not super easy to pivot this kind of tank. <laughs> it is kind of a heavy load. All right, there you go. That's a nice spot for you there. All right, you guys come on out here because they're going to be here pretty soon. They will be here pretty soon, boys. All right. Um, yeah, they're right about here. Our Opal Blitzes are trying. <laughs> they're trying so hard. And they're not getting very far. Yikes. Okay. Um, we got 19 minutes to hold out. I don't think it's going to happen, but gosh dang it, are we going to give it a try? Gosh dang it, are we going to give it a try? Someone hop into that. Um, yeah, I mean... Just, <laughs> it's just so hard. All right, someone go right there, and then yeah, I guess we'll get troopers like this, and that'll be fine. Okay, 18 minutes. Luckily, actually, their tanks are kind of being bogged down. Um, can we self-destruct this? No, we need a crew member in there to do that. Um, they're being bogged down by the Opal Blitzes, actually. They're very focused on hitting the Opal Blitzes, so nothing really is happening. We can actually go in fast speed here. For a little bit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The first of their infantry is coming at us here. Oh, yeah. Special ops? They're sending spec ops at us? No wonder we're losing. Those guys are so hard to kill. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Well, we do have an AP mine uh, field right here, which is nice. Um, oh, another Opal Blitz. Go. Make it. Give us more points. No. <laughs> Didn't work. Okay, that's fine. Well, those are actually causing quite the distraction, which is really nice for us. Um, all right, yeah, we do have two tanks here. Both are pretty bad. Pretty bad tanks. Nothing crazy. What are they sending forward, by the way? Oh, my God, IS-2s? They have IS-2s now? Dear Lord. They expect us to win. Okay, dude, let, get, get you up there. Get you behind there. Um, get you behind there. This will be fine. This will be fine. We're having trouble with two Spec Ops Troopers. But that's because they have crazy health. Spec Ops Troopers have nutty health. Yeah, it's tough. Mm. Take a sip of coffee. It's iced coffee. I got ice cube in it. It's delicious. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. We weirdly have mines here. Got mines at this entrance. Got mines at this entrance. Got mines right here. We have 18 mines scattered across the railroad here. Which is helpful. I don't think we have a crazy number out over here or anywhere, really. I wish I'd put more AT mines over here. We do have, like, a bunch over here, which seems to have caused a little bit of trouble. They had to repair some of these tanks. Um, as you can see, two of them blew up. So, yeah, they did have to... Yeah, they're, they're repairing currently. So, that's actually slowing them down nicely. But here comes a KV-1. And that's where we're going to run into some problems. Ugh! Oh, this tank already got busted. This tank already got busticated. Okay, wow. Well, tank crewman, why don't you go defend the officer over there? You can't really do much else. Actually, why don't you search these crates real quick for us? What, what do they got in them? Anything special? Nothing. They have nothing. Why? What's the point of a crate if it's got nothing in it? All right, that's fine. Get in those uh, trenches right there. You guys hold the uh, officer. 16 minutes. We got 16 minutes. We got to hold out here. All right, we are angling our 
thing here. It is an inside angle, which is worse, but I don't want to move it right now, truth be told. Alright. Oh yeah, an IS-2 versus a Panzer 3N. I think the IS-2 might win that. <laughs> Me thinks. Yep, that, that thing's winning that. <laughs> yep, that's pretty bad. Um, they're taking our railroad over here. Great. Thanks. Good stuff. Yeah, their, their infantry is pretty scattered. If it was just infantry coming forward, we'd certainly be alright, I think. But, uh, it's the tanks. It is the tanks. This tank is having some real trouble. Real trouble. And she's gone. Bye bye Yikes. Um, yeah, our infantry can really just kind of sit there. We do have a AT rifleman who's firing out. Yeah, he's, he's giving it his all. Fred Helm! Is his name, which is kind of funny. <laughs> it's a funny name. Uh, Fred Helm, do your worst. It is not working, Fred Helm. Actually, I might just crouch Fred Helm down. And uh, if a tank gets too close, we could just fire out. Actually, we, we're going to do that with all of our infantry. All infantry, just get on the ground. All infantry on the ground, just belly down. We, we basically are, are in stall tactic mode now. Where um, we just kind of need to hold out for as long as possible. We just gotta hope our mines do some work. Okay, so this is why we, we dropped our boys here down. So this thing can come farther forward. And then we pop up once it gets nice and close to us. What is it aiming at? What is it? What is hitting it? What just shot it? Who did that? I'm a little confused by that. They, they seem a little confused by it too. <laughs> Okay. What are you fi oh, they're firing at this guy. Oh, you're dead. You're big dead. Well, good distraction. Nice job. All right, bring this guy up. Move him over here, and... Yikes, dude. Nothing? Oh, no, we tracked it. Hey, there you go. It also kind of damaged its engine, it looks like, maybe. Well, that's not bad. Oh, the thing that hit it was this guy up here threw an anti-tank grenade down. Oh, you might be falling on your face pretty soon. No, it missed. Nice. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna smoke our, uh... We're gonna smoke our officer. Smoke out! And that'll keep them from shooting him for a little bit. Alright, why don't you take out an anti-tank grenade and run out this way. And... Just throw it right into that thing. Come on. Good stuff. Now run it back. Run it back. Run it back. Nothing? Did nothing happen? Oh, it hit right there and then blew up. Okay. That was useless. Yikes! Dude. Um. Okay. We have 12 minutes of cowarding down here. Alright. They're killing some more of our troopers that are out and about here. Should we smoke again when the time is right? Once this smoke runs out, we'll smoke again. <laughs> this is sad. This is like... This is, uh... Real sad, actually. Okay. The smoke is still active for now. They're, like, hunting us right now. Um... Oh, God. They're trying to, trying to find us with their tanks. It's like Jaws. It's like Jaws. I'm actually hearing... Yeah, AP mines are blowing up over here. We're getting more Soviet kills because of the AP mines. Which is hilarious. Um... Okay, they're still mucking about back there. Uh, the smoke is still good. It's still good for a little bit. So we'll be patient on that for now. Oh, it looks like uh, this ran into some AP mines and broke a wheel. So that's preventing it. Our mining has actually been one of the most successful things we've ever done. Okay, this thing's coming around. I'm throwing another uh, smoke right there. And then... Um, you don't keep it in there. We, we wait for the Panzer Man to pop him up because the second he pops up, he becomes a massive target. So we gotta wait. We gotta be very, very patient with this guy. To be very, very patient. Okay. Now we pop up and get on the ground. Did that do anything? Seems to have halted it almost. It's coming forward again. Pop up. Oh, tracked it. Nice. That's big. Alright. Pop up. What? Oh, we're out of rockets! No! Oh, that's a huge disappointment. Oh, no. Okay. Whew. 
Woo! 11 minutes with no rockets! Big! Okay, this guy's got three smokes, this guy's got two. That's very good for us. Okay. <laughs> Should we fast forward a little bit here? Oh god, the IS-3. Alright, smoke is still going strong. Smoke is still going strong. Alright, I might smoke in a little bit because I don't want it to run out at all. I want it to sort of overlap smokes so they stay strong. Go, smoke now! Ooh, that thing is right up in there. Anyone got an AT mine? Or, or, or AT grenade? This guy does. Yeah, our AT guy does. Oh, no! Go this way. Go, 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 go! Oh, he's dead. He's big dead. Alright, search him. Take those, take those, and start crawling your way through. Yikes. That was kind of my bad. Watch out for enemy officers. They will use flare guns to call in arty and airstrikes. Great. Thank you, Hauptmann. That is good news for the enemy. Bad news for us, yes. Oh, oh. What is that? What are you throwing? Oh, grenade at this guy. Oh, I see. I see. Alright, we killed that guy. Oh, and we blew up. Okay. 9 minutes, 36 seconds of this. That's what we're in for. That is what we're in for. Alright, take out the AT grenade, and uh, how far can you throw that? Not very far. Okay, we gotta, we gotta hold off on that then. We gotta hold off on that. Um, can you move? Like, these guys are like stuck. Oh god! No, get on the ground! Get on the ground! <laughs> no! What are you doing? Oh, that's fine, that's fine. Hey, good job, you tracked it. Okay, cool. Alright. Alright, we are gonna... Oh man, they're shooting at our officer. We're gonna smoke again. We're gonna smoke again in front of the officer. Smoke, smoke, smoke. Come on. Um, let's see. You can smoke. You have two smokes. You have two smokes. Smoke right there in front of us. Yeah. Keep, keep these tanks away. Oh, another one of our guys died. <laughs> oh my god. This is pathetic. Oh god. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. Um, anyone else over here got smokes? Yes. Alright. Before you die, use your smokes up. Oh god. Oh god. Don't run them over, please. Um someone smoke smoke more smoke that's the solution that's what we gotta do boys we have to smoke more we're out of smokes we actually are out of smokes now all right let's just fast forward here and see if we can manage to clutch this up somehow this is the cheesiest lamest tactics one can ever use. oh god how is he alive in there i can't even see him i'm impressed that he didn't get run over right there Wow, they literally just need to send infantry in. Oh, they did, and he died. Wow! Oh my god, we came so close. We were, like, almost at the five-minute mark, which is crazy. Actually crazy. Oh, man, he did die. Oh, he ran up here and then died. Oh, rip, rip, rip. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was a long one, but I had fun doing it. Please be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below if you'd like to see some more. All right, guys, peace out. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.